can we just take a minute and appreciate the beautiful girl gosh i'm glowing child the hair is herring the beauty is beauty everything is perfect guys good morning happy sunday today i'm back again with another prophetic word. hi my loves i mean I'm, I'm confused by my own beauty hey guys hey my loves thank you so much for clicking on this video kindly subscribe 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 <laughs> i'm back again with another prophetic words lucky guy i'm so pretty <laughs> And today's prophetic words, it's a confirmation that you, you are going through the fire, stand firm in the faith. So that is the prophetic word of today. Today, I'm speaking to people who are going through a certain kind of hardships and difficulties, and they feel like their faith is weakening. I'm here to encourage you to check where your faith foundation is at. Is it in Christ or is it in your pastor? Is it in your evangelist? Is it on the person who brought you to Christ? Where is your faith? Remember, Jesus is the rock. If he is your foundation, whatever you are building in faith stands stronger. Any foundation that is in Christ will be strong and will not be swayed. Reminds me of the parable of, there's a certain parable Jesus said of building a house on a rock. I think, I don't know guys, let me know in the comment section. Even you guys should teach me sometimes. Bible reference is 1 Corinthians chapter 3 verses um. 10 to 15 and i'm gonna read the bible today and yeah i hope i'm speaking to someone who feels discouraged in their faith just keep on going gosh i'm pretty <laughs> i'm gonna read um by the grace of god has given me i laid a foundation as a wise builder and someone else is building on it but each one should build with care for no one can lay any foundation other than the one already laid which is jesus christ if anyone builds on this foundation using gold, silver, costly stones, wood, hay, or straw, their work will be shown for what it is, because the day will bring it to light. <laughs> wow. It will be revealed with fire, and the fire will test the quality of each person's work. If what has been built survives, the builder will receive a reward. If it is burnt up, the builder will suffer loss, but yet will be saved even though only as an escaping through the flames guys feel encouraged you guys if you're going through a hardships know that your faith is being tested you know one thing about being in christ is that he's gonna strengthen your faith and be careful of the prayers you pray sometimes you're just like god strengthen my faith i want to have strong faith and you think it's gonna be easy you're going to go through the fire the hardships, the trials, the tribulation, the temptation, so that you can see, are you still trusting God? I was telling someone um, a week ago, or a few days ago, that I, my faith has gotten to that point where I'm not worried about anything. I'm just like, I've surrendered. I'm always, in. A, I feel like normally I'm walking like this, but spiritually I'm walking with my hands up, meaning I have surrendered my life in everything. I'm not worrying about anything. If I hold something and it has to go, I'm letting go of it because I know God got me. I know that I trust him and have faith in him. He's going to work it out. Like Just stop stressing yourself, child. Just learn how to walk in constant form of surrender. Always just surrender everything to God. And I hope this has been a confirmation to some one thank you so much for watching this video i'm gonna check some pictures because mm, hello the gorgeous the gorgeousness is the gorgeous is gorgeous thing bye guys <laughs> not the gorgeous gorgeous thing. go